Good to see you all again. Uh, it's me, of course. Yeah, hope you haven't forgotten my name. Well, it hasn't been that long, has it? Yeah, don't miss me. Okay, right. We've got something really exciting for you happening this week. What is it? It's virtual sports day. So, normally we'll have our normal sports day, council sports day. Of course, we can't. But don't worry, we're still gonna do it and we're gonna do it virtually. You can do it from home. So, how's it gonna, how's it gonna look? We've got four activities that you will get plenty of practice to do so, to complete. Um, you'll get from today up until Friday to practice it. On Friday, you then go online, we'll send you a link, you then record your scores, comes to me, and then we're gonna compare it against Walker Gate. So it's Biker Primary against Walker Gate, virtual sports day, we're not losing. No, no, no. So, question is, what are the four activities and how did it work? Tell you what, let's go and find out. Right, let's find out what we have to do as part of our virtual sports day. Okay, so the first one is a speed bounce. I've done this plenty of time before in school, in PE lessons, festivals, and so on, and it looks really easy. Okay, so what do you need? All you need is some sort of line. So I'm gonna use this line here. You can use some chalk, you can use a lanyard, you can use a towel to make some sort of line. All right, and how does it work? Okay, so what you have to do in 30 seconds is to try and jump over Okay, your line, tell whatever you're using. Okay, so like this. Yeah. Yeah, every time you do that, that will be a point. So this will be one, this will be two, this will be three, this will be four. Okay, if you find it easy, you can do it like this. And that's why it's called speed bounce. All right, or if you find it hard, you can go at your own pace and just go. Jump a line, jump a line. Okay, so it would be 30 seconds you would do that for. Okay, and then of course you would Record all your scores and so on and fill it in. Right, what's the next? You're probably wondering what have I got in my hand. Yeah, I'm the, I'm the same, but let's do this. So, uh, next would be the sock and spoon race. Yep, got a sock, clean as always. Spoon, clean as always. And I've got two items, okay? <laughs> Ground, black pepper. I've sopped, I've sopped um, my tin tomatoes and beans. And then I've got some cooking season, salt. Yep, I can't cook, still can't cook, but it is what it is. Right, so how do I do it? One item down, I'll take about five steps, five, four steps. One, two, three, four, five. Right, and I'll put another one down. Okay, so, sock and spoon. 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 Hey, Miss Try Ballet on my spoon. So I need to keep it like this. Alright. Walk around. This will be one. There you go. Doesn't matter. I've still got my one point. Put it on. practicing okay let's find out what the next one is and then of course on Friday it's time to put it all in action on to the next one then so what have we got for you we've got a bit of target throw so a bit of front all right what I need bucket some to throw it in and I've got five items soccer stain and then I've got four white ball pens all right so how does it work put my target down at any distance that I would like. All right, you can get it closer, you can have further away. If you want to further away, challenge yourself, be even better. If you want to closer, that's not a problem, all right? So, start here. I need to try and get it, of course, into my target, all right? So I've got five items, all right? So I'll try it. And then that's one, ha! That's how you do it. <laughs> Maybe not. Wow. So I'm to find them back, but then you sprint, collect them all quickly, come back, and you go again. Better than me, of course. Oh, wow. Yep. I got two again. Can you, can you see why I've given you all week to practice? Because this is why. <laughs> all right, <laughs> to, get, to, to get it perfect. So, this is what it looks like. You can um, try your own distance. You can have far away. You can have a close away. I'm close to you, sorry. And of course, you'll be 30 seconds. You, you do that for 30 seconds, then of course, every time you get it in, that's a point. Within 30 seconds, you're out of all your points, and you'll go online on Friday and you'll submit the score and so on, and no cheer. All right, so, yeah, again, same as all the ones. Thank you, practice for the whole week. Come back on Friday, and it's time for the action.
Let's go to the last activity that we would do as part of our virtual sports day. All right, oh, the sun is coming out, Tom. Even better. Is standing long jumps. So yeah, again, I see two items. All right, and this is how you do it. Pretty really simple. So I'll put one item down. This will be my starting point. All right, I'll try and jump as far as I can, of course. Bend my knees, I can use my arm for power. All right, jump, and then And this will be my finishing. Um, this will be my landing spot. So now I've got my distance, all right? So I've got that and that. This is how I do it then. So in 30 seconds, all right, I will try, okay, and land where my end, end, end target is there. So go for me. That'll be one point. Come back. Okay, two, or you can do it like this if you want. You can jump here, land there, one, turn around, two, three. And then the key is, of course, to see when I land. Okay, knees bend, find your balance, turn around, okay, use your arms, bend your knees, bow up, and land. Okay, so yeah, same as all the other activities that we've done today you've got from today up until Friday to practice okay I'm gonna do it myself as well yes I know you think you should do it yeah I will and I'm also gonna tell you my scores on Wednesday all right so get practicing okay and then it's time for go to sports day